name is Grace and today I'm going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is 24 chapter The Beautiful House of God Chapter 1 Kings 5 to 8 Let's read <coughs> Peter Wall was talking What is King Solomon doing? He is building a house of God. It will be the beautiful temple. So King Saul was still a king. And everyone liked King Saul because King Saul was very wise. And they were asking each other what what's King Saul doing? And they were saying he was building a house of God. Hiram, king of Tyre, was a friend of David. Give me the best wood to build the house of God. Solomon asked Hiram for the best wood for the temple. Ask for the best. King Hiram gave Solomon the best wood. King Solomon gave Hiram food for the people of trade. King Solomon sent 3,000 people to King Hiram to bring the wood. So Solomon asked King Hiram to give the best wood to build the house of God. Instead, Solomon gave the food. King Solomon sent 3,000 people to King Haram to bring wood. King Solomon had 8,000 stone cutters. Solomon had 7,000 carriers. He had over 3,000 foremen. The king made them cut the stones to lay the foundation of the temple. Many people trimmed the stone to build the temple. So, like many people, help King Solomon to build the new temple. Like he had eight thousand stone cutters and seven thousand carriers, and he had three hundred four men. Like it is amazing. Like. There is also the 3,000 people to carry the woods. Some people work with silver and gold. They covered the inside of the temple with gold. They had many things for the temple. Some people work with clocks. So many people was there. Mm -hmm. Sorry. We have read the fourth story. So, gold and silver. Also, many people worked inside to cover inside very nicely. Like, they Covered the and it's like gold and silver. Wow, <laughs> it took seven years for King Solomon to finish the temple. The temple was big and beautiful. King Solomon gathered all the ladders of Israel, all the holy things were put in the temple. They worshiped God 
when they finish the worship. <clears throat> the temple was filled with God's cloud. The temple was filled with God's glory. So it took seven years. Wait a minute, what's happening? I don't know. <laughs> it took seven years. I don't know it take long time or short. Maybe it was a short time in these days because like they also did didn't have port cranes or those things. Like they don't know all by themselves with it, their hands or something. Wow. And Solomon also gathered all the leaders of Israel and they worshipped God. When they were worshiping, the temple was filled with God's cloud and God's glory. King Solomon gathered all the people of Israel. He praised God in the new temple. <coughs> King Solomon prayed God with the people. We praise you. Please stay with us. Please help us love you the israel were happy because of the grace of god sorry does my mother <coughs> king solomon gathered all the israel people and they worshiped god in that new temple it will be wonderful the king solomon prayed with the peoples and they prayed for the Israel and for them. I think maybe the temple will be like this. But I am drawing the inside part. Like they will be the Ark. In the Ark, there is Mania and Aaron's stuff. In the stuff, like in Aaron's stuff, there is a flower on it. But it is very, you know, surprising. And there will also be. Oh, ten comments. There is ten comments, and there will be the curtain, very thick curtain. It is because in these days they couldn't meet God. Like this, and there will be peoples. And there will be goals. Actually, it will be more beautiful than this. <laughs> Sorry, that's my project. Sorry, that's my project. And today, oh, the Bible story today, it was fun or not. <laughs> then let's see you next time. Bye.